Welcome all to WHO's World Hand Hygiene Day 2022. Professor Anand Balki, uh, WHO Assistant Director General for Antimicrobial Resistance, and myself are really delighted to introduce you to this year 5th of May Hand Hygiene Campaign and Day. And then please uh, tell us more about the theme of the World Hand Hygiene Day 2022. With pleasure, Didier. Many thanks. I'm excited to be here with you today celebrating World Hand Hygiene 2022. This year's theme for World Hand Hygiene is focused on quality and safety climate or culture, recognizing that people at all levels can work together to influence the culture and climate of safety and quality through clean hands to meet the common goal of safety and quality in healthcare delivery. A strong quality and safety culture will encourage and support people to clean hands at the right time with the right products. In other words, health workers at all levels and people accessing healthcare facilities need to unite on ensuring clean hands. The slogan is Unite for Safety, Clean Your Hands, and this spirit of unity and joint venture is reflected in the campaign image. There is uh, still a lot of room for improvement in hand hygiene practices around the world, as you probably know, Nan. Also, a lot of progress has been made. One way is to improve the safety climate and culture in healthcare facilities and also in other institutions. Safety climate has many definitions. What does safety climate or culture mean? An organizational uh, environment that prioritizes high compliance with hand hygiene and other infection prevention and control or so-called IPC practices to achieve patient and health worker safety. At the institutional level, this means the allocation of resources for hand hygiene and IPC interventions and clear messages of support for hand hygiene from leaders, setting benchmarks or targets and having hand hygiene champions. This applies at the health facility as well as national level. At an individual level, healthcare workers, including policy makers, identifying hand hygiene and IPC as a priority and reflecting their commitment to do no harm to patients. And last but not least, partnering with patients and patient organizations to promote hand hygiene and other IPC measures may also promote a claim climate of patient safety. It is critical to direct attention to organizational safety climate to ensure further sustainable hand hygiene improvement. This is why this is one of the five elements of the WHO hand hygiene multimodal strategy. Several WHO global surveys, including one recently published in the Lancet Infectious Diseases, have identified the element of institutional safety climate as the least implemented, as can be seen in this figure, where its score is the lowest compared to other four elements, to the other four elements of the WHO multimodal strategy. This needs to be improved because it is proven that when health institutions unite on quality and safety climate or a culture which values hand hygiene and IPC, these results in patients and healthcare workers feeling protected and cared for. Yes, indeed, D-Day. Hand hygiene improvement must be embedded in the wider organizational quality and safety initiatives at all levels. I totally agree. That has been our previous lives, me and you, or my previous and your current. To achieve this goal, different people will play a critical role. Thus, similar to previous years, the WHO campaign materials address and engage different audiences. So let's look at the calls to action for 2022. It is important to note that this year's approach for thanking people is a positive way of engaging them to take further action. 
Therefore, health workers, thank you for leading by example and encouraging others to clean their hands. Please continue to act as role models to your colleagues. Talk and buddy up with new employees or junior colleagues to support and promote hand hygiene at the right times with the right products. The next message is to infection prevention and control practitioners. Thank you for engaging health workers to be part of new hand hygiene initiatives. You are critical mentors for all health workers in your facility to support and engage them in new hand hygiene initiatives to help improve hand hygiene compliance and provide safe and quality care. And now to quality and safety leads. Thank you for working with infection prevention control colleagues to support hand hygiene improvement. Make a clear commitment towards supporting hand hygiene improvement and safety benchmarks and targets. And next is facility managers, Anan. Thank you for promoting a quality and safety culture to ensure clean hands. Effective implementation of hand hygiene best practices requires your action through reliable and uninterrupted provision of good quality hand hygiene resources, including alcohol-based hand rub, of course, supplies of clean water, soap, single-use towels, and an adequate number of functioning sinks. And now, Didier, of course, very critical policymakers. Thank you for prioritizing resources, training, and programs on hand hygiene. You are critical to showing political commitment to strengthen the enabling environment that continuously aims to improve implementation of hand hygiene guidelines and adherence to so. People will use health care. We are talking to you now. Both Anan and myself are talking to you. Thank you for getting involved in local hand hygiene campaigns and activities. Together, let us unite with anyone who need to use the healthcare system. Everyone can be part of campaigning for a quality and safe culture with hand hygiene at its heart. Now, we would like to inform you of a range of promotional materials to energize your hand hygiene activities and to show your participation and support to WHO's Global Hand Hygiene Campaign 2022. To show your support for the campaign, download the campaign posters, which are available in many languages. Access the websites and download the posters. Add the campaign banner to your email signature block. Use the World Hand Hygiene Day 2022 background. Download and personalize selfies boards. Print the Unite for Safety, Clean Your Hands, flag and web banners to be used in your institution ahead of and on 5th of May 2022. Arrange a display of the 2022 campaign posters and other materials on your facilities, walls, computers, educational talks, and so on and so on. Also be innovative and create your own personalized version of the 5th of May campaign posters to print, post, share with your colleagues. Showcase on social media, post pictures and videos of leadership, facility managers, quality and safety managers demonstrating their support towards hand hygiene, pledging their commitment to the campaign or ensuring hand hygiene supplies are made continuously available. Great today, thank you, that's amazing. WHO also once again thanks you for continually demonstrating your facility's commitment to an organizational safety climate that ultimately leads to hand hygiene improvement. We have made available a campaign toolkit and each year we encourage you to show support by signing up for the Save Lives Clean Your Hands campaign on our webpage. Finally, promote and take part in suggested healthcare facility activities and organized events as part of the quality and safety climate going forward. 
This activity can be conducted in any healthcare setting, as well as outreach settings by infection prevention and control focal points and other healthcare leaders. Instructions for setting up the cafe and a promotional flyer for use at facility level are available for you on the WHO web pages. Showcase your country story by describing the health facility's quality and safety climate or culture and how it has valued uh, hand hygiene and IPC and has supported sustained improvement. Attend the WHO technical webinar and teleclass on hand hygiene on May 5th, 2022. Find information on the campaign page. Thank you everyone for your support. Well, let me tell you, reaffirm your commitment, unite, talk and work together on hand hygiene for future progress and ultimately improved quality and safer care. And Anan, let's say together, unite, unite for, for safety, safety. Clean, clean your hands. hands. <laughs>